Hi family, welcome to my channel. If you are a returning OG subscriber, a special welcome back to you. And if you are new, welcome. All the information that you need is in the description box below. Other than that, let's jump right into your channel message, okay? Because the energy that I received, um, I heard spontaneous in surplus okay so i feel like something that you're doing on the whim all right this is unexpected for you very unexpected for others and i feel like this is going to bring in like unexpected results for you okay so there's something that you're getting ready to do um you could be launching something i do feel a heavy entrepreneur energy here but i feel like there's something you're getting ready to launch that's going to um exceed your expectations as well as sales all right so there's some type of oh wow there's some type of spontaneous blessing unfolding yeah we have the hierophant in the first card out so this is strong ascension energy i feel like you've unlocked something new for yourself here okay i want to say taurus so you definitely could be a taurus it is taurus season but this feels like the energy of like um next level okay i feel like a new door is opening for you i'm getting something about a portal or a full moon phase or a phase here where you activated something in your energy all right i'm getting strong aquarius vibes as well here but the fact that the hierophant jumped out and we are in taurus season is amazing so happy birthday taurus if it is your birthday and you are a taurus okay so let's see, highest loving angels and ancestors. So I'm getting, yeah, with the six of wands, everyone is going to be collectively benefiting from tour season with the six of wands. This feels like success, okay? I feel like someone here, I don't know why I'm here upstage here, but I'm getting a round of applause, okay? People have been waiting for something that you provide, okay? I feel like you found a need and you decided to fill it. Someone here is becoming a multimillionaire, okay? I feel like this is an entrepreneur, but, like, God is definitely reminding you of your worth right now when it comes to something. Because I feel like whatever you've built is worth a significant amount of money. Yeah, we have the six of swords. So, I feel like you are in this energy of letting go, okay? I'm hearing the art of letting go. You are releasing with these crows. I feel like there's a darker side or there's more to your story here. All right? I feel like there's a lot that people don't know about you here in a situation. This could be in the workplace. I do feel this energy of you being extremely mysterious yeah we have the devil card out here yeah so i feel like yeah you're trying to release something i feel like the devil wants to pull you back this demonic energy whatever this is this feels like an entity that wants to bring negativity into your life but this feels like you have a rain on something all right i feel like with this devil card someone here doesn't know how strong you are or you are basically i feel like you've been through this shadow phase more than once okay you definitely could be a scorpio here all right, but I definitely feel that Phoenix energy with this Six of Swords. But there's something you've mastered. So I feel like the devil is trying to confuse you because the way the hair is sticking up, I feel a lot of headspace energy. So definitely take care of your crown chakra. Meditate as often as possible with this Hierophant. Okay. Yeah, we have the Eight of Wands, so this is communication here. I'm getting a group of people coming to an agreement, so I feel like you're going to be receiving communication about a payment with this pink here. Okay, this is a lot of crown chakra energy for me. So I really feel like there's some type of uh, download, okay, synchronicities. God is really trying to get your attention t during this time, okay? I feel like these synchronicities are there to remind you of your worth, it's definitely, especially with the Six of Wands and the Six of Swords. I feel like you're transmuting some type of energy here and i feel like you could be doing it in a public eye you could be helping people transmute energy through a platform that you have here yeah we have the ace of pinnacles so this seed i feel like a seed that you've planted you're getting ready to plant something sprouting this is beautiful this feels like harvest actually with this ace of pinnacles yeah we have the strength card okay so leo you definitely could be a leo here but i feel this energy of like um the sacrificial lamb in the situation i feel like you went through a lot as a child growing up i feel like you spent a lot of like your teenage years taking care of others and now the divine wants to take care of you here and i feel like the devil wants to confuse your purpose all right i do feel this energy of evil eyes so make sure you are cleansing your space as often as possible my loves all right but i feel like there's a financial blessing on the horizon here for you 
and it's happening in front of people with that six of wands okay something about this next blessing god is going to be broadcasting it yeah we have the hangman okay so pisces energy all right so i feel like someone here um is heavily attracted to shoes okay you could customize shoes here but i feel like your clientele is going to be increasing with this hangman i'm getting this energy of word of mouth because someone's very introverted i feel like you're shy okay but you are an entrepreneur you want to start a business but i feel like you're getting over the shyness or the fear of speaking to people yeah knight of wands so heavy fire energy leo energy here i'm also getting someone spending a lot of time with their ancestors in a new way all right so i feel like they're letting you know like i said if you unlock something new on your ascension journey all right, i do feel this energy of you passing some type of test yeah this is bringing in a manifestation for you i feel like this something's materializing into your physical yeah, and this Hierophant feels like you are limitless in your earning potential as well with this Knight of Wands. I feel like whatever new you opened up, because I feel like you've asked for this. This feels like a ritual. I don't want to say a seance energy, but I really feel like there's something you've prayed for, you've manifested. All right, I feel like you've raised your vibration up in order to receive this. Yeah, we have the High Priestess. Wow, beautiful energy. So I'm getting something about custom beads, custom jewelry. These earrings on her are beautiful. So I'm hearing like Moon Child. So this could be the name of your business here with this High Priestess. But I really feel like you're using your intuition to guide you to make the pieces. So I'm getting someone here that's an intuitive jewelry maker. All right, you could make intention jewelry. Let's see, highest of angels and ancestors. Wow, we have the judgment card with the hangman. This feels like freedom. All right, I feel like you are free from any witchcraft, any spell work here. All right, but this does not stop people from hating. So I feel like the divine needs you to continue to stay in this free falling into the universe energy because I feel like you're doing something with ease, with balance. All right, you're learning more about your journey. All right, with the scriptings in the water. All right, so I feel like someone here is a heavily charged or in tuned water sign, or you have strong water sign placements mixed with fire. Yeah, we have the lovers. So more confirmation that communication is coming in. All right, I feel this energy of an email. All right, but I feel like there's someone that wants to work closely with you with this very intimate energy. All right, I feel like someone here wants to help you improve your business. Somebody here sees you as a very powerful businessman or businesswoman. So for some reason with this lovers, I'm getting a strong attraction. All right, so I feel like you are very attractive. I'm hearing Sagittarius. You definitely could be a Sagittarius or there's a Sag Sagittarius that is extremely attracted to you. Yeah. And I'm getting a Pisces here with that's going to be receiving a, a raise or a promotion. But this feels like, yeah, someone's attracted to you, okay, as far as your business. This doesn't have to be romantic. But I really feel like someone's attracted to you. And I said Sagittarius, and look at what's on the arm. Come on now. All right, so you could be a Sagittarius, or Sagittarius energy is significant for this particular message here. But there is a spontaneous blessing, okay? I feel like this is expansion because Sagittarius rules expansion, okay? Something is growing larger larger or becoming well-known on a wider scale here. Yeah, we have two of wands, so there's this energy of planning. You could be planning a road trip to travel across country. But I feel like something about, like I said, spontaneity. Somebody here is going to be taking a spontaneous trip. There's a strong sense of uh, spontaneous energy. But yeah, I feel like the divine is like going to be blessing you, unexpected energy. Yeah, Knight of Wands. So with this Knight of Wands, I really feel like there's this really sense of passion. I feel like you're doing something from the heart. This Knight of Wands feels like intention. You're taking action with intention. You're creating something with intention. And it's bringing forth like powerful results. Yeah, we have the Queen of Swords. Yeah, you're serious about something. All right, I feel like you're getting really disciplined. I feel like you're you're sick of your finances being in a certain state. I feel like when I feel like this message applies to a strong group of my entrepreneurs. All right, especially if you are a light worker. But with this Queen of Swords here, this really feels like you guys are moving on to the next thing. Okay, you guys have your sights set ahead here. So strong Aquarius energy. All right, so you have a uh, strong Leo Sagittarius placements. I'm getting Leo Sagittarius sun. All right, with some type of air rising. Okay, I've been getting a lot of rising energy. Wow. I feel like I'm hearing you have everything you need for this journey. 
All right, so there's something new that you're doing. Yeah, because we have the will. I feel like this change needs to happen. Yeah, with this uh, dice here, like I said, there's a risk. There's something unexpected. There's this spontaneous energy, and there's more fire. All right, Aries is here. You definitely could be an Aries. Hi, so the angels and ancestors. Can I get one more card? Thank you. Wow, King of Swords. Yeah, so something's getting ready to take off, take flight. I feel like your business is going to a new level with these steps. All right, there's an increase happening. This energy feels like strong increase, and these crows feel like you are defeating your demons or whatever negative energy is sent to destroy you one by one. As well as I feel like, as well as I feel like. These crows are representing pr protection for something. Yeah, because this owl is here. So I feel like you've gained more knowledge. You've learned more about something. Now you're ready to take flight. You're ready to do something. Okay, I feel like the time is now. So this could be like your angels really urging you to start this business. Yeah, we have this Ace of Wands. I feel like you've been having a lot of dreams, a lot of visions, a lot of downloads coming to you. And you could be feeling as though you share them or not. The divine is like, share them. Yeah, we have the Two of Swords, this conflicted energy. All right, so I feel like something was coming in to keep you stuck, to get you out of this unbalanced meditative state, but something's being restored with this King of Swords energy. Yeah, I feel like you are elevating. God is putting you up higher or further, even further. I feel like people aren't going to know where you live. Someone here is relocating with that Queen of Swords unexpectedly, like swift. It's going to be happening very quickly. Very, very fast. All right. So let's see what else. Highest of angels and ancestors. Woo. Wow. We have earth angel coming out here. So I really feel this is your energy. All right. I feel like I'm speaking to my light workers here. I feel like you could be doubting your position or what it is that you've been called to do here. But I feel like you just need to keep pushing. Yeah. And we have keep them out of your plan. So I feel like right now it's very, very important that you move in silence. Okay? I'm here. Don't tell your left hand what your right hand is going to do because we have successful public figure. There's the strong sense of you being in the public eye. All right? I'm here. You can handle it. You got this. Higher seven angels, ancestors. Woo. Wow, so we have in the next 24 hours and 100,000. So I feel like there's, like I said, there's that surplus energy. So your angels are, and then we have supernatural. Wow, didn't I say spontaneous? Then we have supernatural blessings, okay? So this 100,000, all right, this 100K is coming to you very fast in the very near future, in the next 24 hours, all right? I feel like you can expect very positive change very quickly. Yeah, we have sign-on bonus. So this 100000 definitely could come in the form of a sign-on bonus. Like I said, you are limitless in your earning potential. Okay, so this could be a surplus sign-on bonus. Okay, but this is a supernatural blessing. Something you didn't see coming. Someone's getting hired. I'm getting in the next 24 hours. All right, you're going to be hearing back about something very fast. I'm getting really quick turnaround time in the situation. Wow. Yeah, we have energetic overload. So I really feel like it's time to step back. Like I said, meditate more, worry less. Because I feel like you've been really trying to, uh, like, expand something with that Sagittarius energy. You could be figuring out how you're going to do that here. But I feel like the divine is going to make something happen for you. This could be a, a business loan worth, like, 30000 35000 or 100000 here. But in the next 24 hours, you're receiving some type of surplus, sign-on bonus, salary increase, supernatural sign-on bonus. It's beautiful. This is beautiful energy. So let me see what the color oracle has to say. What else? Hi, so many angels. What other messages do you have? Yeah, we have reflection. So then I say dark night of the soul energy. So you could be experiencing the need to heal. Like, I mean, really heal. Like, meditate in a heavy way i feel like there's this energy of needing to set some type of like 90 day 30 day 20 day 7 day goal for yourself when it comes to meditation 
okay, I feel like this needs to be a regular practice for you. Yeah, creativity. This is going to help you produce more ideas. I feel like someone here could feel stuck. You could feel blocked. And with this devil card, I feel like you don't need to focus on who or what is doing witchcraft, playing with dirt or none of that right now. I just need you to protect yourself as we all should. But I feel like there's something you're diving too deeply into with this Capricorn energy. I'm hearing the occult. Something's fucking with your mind. So definitely be careful. I tell y'all all the time, like, slow down on the tarot, okay? Because I know it's entertaining. I know a lot of these, I know a lot, a lot of people do it and watch it for the entertainment. But with this growth here, I feel like you need to pay attention. Is Are the message you receiving helping you grow or are they making you paranoid i feel like you just really need to decipher yeah we have you should, look intuition something's fucking with your intuition or something's blocking your intuition i don't know what this energy is for you take it where it applies but this is very like look we have passion so i feel like this is the focus right now this is what needs to be focused on right now Especially, yeah, stop. So someone here needs to slow down with the occult energy. All right, tapping in too deeply because I feel like you're receiving too many. Look, didn't I say occult? We have mystery. All right, I feel like you're trying to find out more information about something. I'm hearing cliffhanger. Someone here has, like, left you on a cliffhanger. This, this could be another tarot reader. All right, but I feel like someone here left you on a cliffhanger about something and it puts you in this state of being paranoid you isolated everyone all right but i really feel like there's good people around you here but i feel like you just definitely need to slow down slow down okay kind of seven angels and ancestors wow yeah we have energy something's being manipulated here but that that's not my business y'all gonna do what y'all want to do but definitely be careful of how you feel because i'm because a, a lot of tarot is gossip like it's not real energy work they keep feeding you this shit to keep bringing you back okay wanting to know more about who's doing what to you and the haters and this this and that that shit is whack that shit is whack and i feel like somebody here needs to really uh re realign or reevaluate your energy but we're gonna see what the ancestors have to say but it feel like they getting on y'all today. Or someone. Yeah, we have naked. So stripping you down. Yeah. Vulnerability. I feel this energy of like, you really are very sensitive. Okay. Alright, so you could really connect um, with water or mermaids. Okay, I'm getting someone here. has. A, I'm hearing someone has a mermaid theme apartment or a mermaid theme business. Yeah, we have level up. You're going to the next level. Some shit you got to cut out swiftly with that machete. Swiftly. I'm getting with that. The way she looks. Protect your energy. Because you see how she's dressed? That's, that, that looks beautiful to me. Those are beautiful threads she has on. As well as this seat is flo floating. So your throne is rising. Your status is increasing here. And I feel like you definitely need to be careful of the energy that you intake. All right. Wow. So let's get one more card for my favorite deck. Yeah, we have it's time for healing, not war. So what did I say? It's definitely time for more meditation, less drama, less gossip. 30 here. So we have 30. 30. So 333 three, three could be very significant. 313. But I'm definitely getting with this. It's time for healing, not war. Something is just keeping your vibration down with this gray and all this ash and shit i feel like something is over it's gone it can't be resurrected here and i feel like you're still stuck in this so definitely make sure you're cleansing your energy during this time but there's something coming up like i said with the portal full moon no moon i don't, I don't really i'm not really sure but yeah we have let them go so it's, whatever this is them could be a person, a place, an opportunity. This energy is holding on too tightly. I feel like you need to cut the cords. If you see them strings there, you need to cut cut cords. Yeah, we have potion. Remember to practice self-love. So this really, really feels like you guys, like I said, are working with energy. You're healing your energy. Continue to do this. Stay focused. I, I feel like self-love is the quickest way to boost your confidence or increase your energy Let's see. One card. <laughs> Ooh. 
Yep, so we have feast. Yeah, feast. Slow down and celebrate yourself. So I feel like you've been really putting in work here. I wanted to say Virgo. Even though this is a collective read, you could definitely be a Virgo. You've been putting in real work. I feel like it's time for you to enjoy the fruits of your labor. Make sure you're taking a break. I feel like a vacation would suffice. It would do you well, all right? Because I feel like you need to. You need some type of inspiration. Like I said, some type of spontaneous road trip or a spontaneous event is really going to help you understand your worth. And you'll be able to celebrate this new achievement or this offer that you receive. Wow. This this surplus salary increase. This is beautiful. So that is the message. I hope you enjoyed this spread as much as I enjoy reading it for you. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't already. Hit that notification bell so you are notified every time I upload. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye.